What up, players? It's Warbots Tay up in this mood. Happy Sunday to all y'all. Welcome to my Project Dwarfs, Project Stunty, day number 13, November 13 today. And I am showing you what I got done today. My progress isn't too much. I got all of the silver metallics down for my hammerers as well as the red arm sleeves. I tried out some of the tartan designs and they just seemed like a little bit too detailed and time consuming. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to give these guys all a uniform sleeve color. If you look back at my other units, they, they don't all have a uniform sleeve color. So I think it's going to be pretty cool to, to unify them as well as uh, here the command group in the back. I also did the beginnings of the banner here, the unit banner, or standard I guess, and I painted in the gold detailing on the banner, not on the rest of the troop yet. But I'm still trying to figure out what I'm going to put in the middle, what design I'm going to draw. I'm not really that great at the freehand, so I've been looking at some, you know, some things I've been finding online. I had to paint the red rim. Um, I, I, I think it was a good idea to do that. It breaks it up. It also gives a good spot color to the rest of the, the sleeves, but still looking for designs. i try and figure out what I'm going to put in there. Uh, here are my two test models and a third model that I did just to just to try um, try and remember how I did these hammers. And um, yeah, I think they came out great. What I'm really happy with is that these guys don't have eyeballs, so that's going to shave off a lot of time once I get all my base coats down. But Today I was just really focusing on getting the metallics and the sleeves done and also shaving off some mold lines, some really bad mold lines that I saw in a couple of my models. There are still some that don't bother me as much. So tomorrow my goal is to get the, hopefully the rest of the base coats down. Um, I've been kind of busy not only with Skyrim and Modern Warfare 3 but also I've picked up another gig that I'm doing in my other professional outside hobby life so that's taking up a lot of my time um, and so I didn't get a chance to work the full three hours today I was really kind of like Christopher from AG production just kind of planning out my week and getting some extra work done on all of that but wanted to show you my in progress works in progress shots and hopefully tomorrow when when you check back more of them will be done and I'll have more time to hobby and do other stuff I've got a bunch of tutorials and and um, just other videos that I want to show you guys that I've got in the works that have just kind of been pushed on the back backlog because I wanted to do a little bit with these guys every single day. Hopefully when these guys are done in cross fingers, you know, the next week or so, then I'll have more time to devote to doing other stuff. I'll have finished the painting challenge a little bit early and I can move on to other stuff that you guys will like. So. Thanks a lot for joining me, and hope this was of some inspiration to you. It's just uh, all this batch painting after a while makes you go kind of nutty. So, <laughs> so I think after after the metallics and the and the sleeve colors, um, just got to take it in little bits and chunks. And then once you've got all the base colors down, then doing the washes and the highlights are going to be a lot easier. So, thanks for watching, and post a video response if you're doing your own painting challenge. Let me. Let, uh, let us all see, all of our YouTube people, community, see what your progress has been over this weekend. And um, stick with it. Don't worry about, you know, if you don't feel like you got that much done. Uh, just, just keep doing a little bit every single day. A little bit a day helps to get you to that painting goal that you have. So, yeah, thanks for watching. Have a great rest of the day off for those of you who had Veterans Day weekend off, just like I did. I, I hope you were able to get rested and and re-energized and ready for the week ahead. And yeah, so that's it. So thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.